And that was not my best swim. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Honestly, don't care what I look like when I go and walk my dog. I literally have the ugliest outfit on because I just rolled straight out of bed. Her walk is more important than me having to freshen up first. So this is this is the fit. my coffee I took a quick shower I don't really know why because I'm planning on going to the swimming pool later today to exercise in the water a bit because um, this is kind of like the last day I'm gonna be able to do that because I have a surgery coming up and after the surgery not really allowed to swim for about two weeks probably four weeks two weeks or four weeks i don't know so i was thinking that we could go to the swimming pool to exercise because it has been one of my favorite things to do but first i need to do some work mail and i also wanted to follow an online class so i'm gonna do that as well if you've been following me for some time you should know that i finished college last year but I do think that it's really important to keep on learning and to keep on growing. So I decided to try out Skillshare, which is also the sponsor for today's video. So thank you so much Skillshare for sponsoring this video. So I study communication in creative industries. So the creative industries is something for me that I just love to be a part of. And Skillshare makes it possible for me to stay engaged with this community. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring and creative classes for anyone who loves learning. Invest in yourself and your personal growth. Do you have a specific skill that you're trying to learn? Then Skillshare is the perfect place for it. In school, I always had to work with like Adobe Photoshop, Illustrator and all that and Adobe After Effects. Uh, Adobe Premiere Pro. I use Premiere Pro to edit my videos in. I consider myself a beginner and I really want to like establish making super cool videos or super cool edits in any of the Adobe programs and Skillshare has these great classes for that. So what I'm gonna do today probably is I'm gonna follow a class in film and video. So I think that today I'm gonna follow the class Animation for Graphic Design and How to Animate a Logo by William Kessling. I have a logo at the beginning of my videos, but I kind of want to switch it up. Um, but that logo wasn't made by myself, it was made 
by a friend of mine so i don't really know how to animate a logo so i kind of want to learn that so i'm probably going to do that today because i think it's really interesting and really really cool so if you really feel like you want to learn about photography or editing or just filming in general or they even have cooking classes then you should really go and check out Skillshare because I think it's really amazing. It helps you learn new skills and master old ones. You can meet like-minded people like me and join a diverse community. So if you are ready to start exploring your creativity today, I really recommend trying it out and signing up because the first 1,000 people will get a free trial for one month for Skillshare. So link is down below in my description and thank you Skillshare so much for sponsoring this video. Okay. I'm gonna go and start this class now and then I have some work meal to do and I will see you guys after that. Okay, I think I'm ready to go for swim. This is literally the bathing suit that I had when I swam when I was 16, 17, 18 years old. I'm 25 now uh, and it still fits. So I'm glad I never threw it away because these things are so expensive. Um, and I can't really go swimming in my bikini because that's just that's not comfortable everything will just like slip off so we're gonna put this bad girl on and then we're gonna head to the swimming pool and I think I'm just gonna swim for like 40 minutes or something but at least it's something and not nothing okay I'll be right back okay what do we think of the fit? I don't think you can really see it. You can see it in the in the mirror in the back, but it fits perfectly. Do you mind if I go for a swim real quick? I'll be home in about an hour and 15 minutes. Is that okay? And then after that, we're gonna go for a walk again. Is that okay? I'm gonna give you a treat. Follow me. See ya. Okay, there you go. That was not my best swim. I'm not gonna lie. I think I swam for about 20 minutes. Yeah, my body wasn't feeling it at all. I've talked about my neuropathy in my feet. And normally when I'm swimming, I don't really feel much of it. But today it was just, I don't know, every single time I did this with my feet, I could just feel the pressure of the water on my feet and I, it just was uncomfortable. And then, also, my right side started to um, started to bother me. And I don't think I've ever mentioned this, but ever since my lung surgery, which was on this side, I have three scars here. Um, ever since my lung surgery, I lost feeling on the right side of my body. And it's been kind of rough because it's so weird not to feel anything. So it's my breasts, so my right breast like touching it, I don't feel this. It feels, I don't know, undescribable. Uh, I can't feel the back of my arm. And when there is a lot of pressure on it, uh, it just, it feels like there's tiny little needles um, poking my skin and I can't feel my armpit and, the, and this part. So that's really difficult when you have to shave your armpit because you won't feel a thing when you're like, making any scratches and I've done that a couple times when my doctor asked me like how did your lung surgery go I told him that it went well I just lost feeling on my right side and he's like well it can take a while for that to recover because 
it sounds like we hit some nerves and um, that we damaged the nerves on the right side. And he told me that like 10 years ago or like a few years ago, he had like a surgery at his collarbone area and he still wasn't able to feel that. So I'm really hoping that I get the feeling back though, because especially the breast, it's really annoying. Putting on a bra, really annoying. Hand placement, really annoying. Like I can't. Putting on lotion or something, really, I, 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 this is a no-go area. Like don't even get close to this part of my body. I wear a lot of like sticky tape for, you know, instead of a bra for some tops that looks a little nicer but having to take them off it just feels undescribable like sometimes I feel pain but it's not like irregular like pain it's not like like just pressure body that's not what I feel I feel like my breast is somewhere else and it's just I don't know it's hard to explain anywho it was really bothering me with swimming because the pressure on my body just felt weird so I decided to call it quits because you know I don't want to put my body through things it doesn't want to be put through so we're not doing that uh, and that's absolutely fine I mean I did swim for 20 minutes so I can be proud of that I did go out to go and work out so that's a good thing so um yeah let's just go back I think it's time to go back to Zia I think she's missing me I don't know Let's hope she misses me. Um, and I'm hungry. I need a good lunch. And I still have leftover food from last night's dinner. So I think I'm gonna eat that. Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> take a two-hour nap together yes do I still have work to do and do I still have an apartment to clean before my floor is being finished tomorrow yes I just made myself a nice little cheese board she is interested in this one uh -uh. Uh -uh. because she's actually obsessed with cheese she has this special cheese all for herself as a treat so I might just give her a little something from that because I'm torturing her with the cheese right now. So, but I made myself a little cheese board for dinner because I didn't really feel like cooking. And I also have, I saw this on TikTok. There was this girl that, I can't remember her name, but there was this girl that was trying to like pickles because she absolutely hates the taste of pickles. And she was eating all types of these pickles. So I, I, I saw these at the Asian market and I got three of them. And we're gonna try the hot mama. I love spicy food, let me just. <laughs> I love spicy food, so I'm really wondering. It says to tear here. Are you also excited for the pickle? Uh -uh. It's massive. Oof, do you smell that? Smell that. That's weird. Okay, here we go. I don't like it. It is a little bit spicy. So that's good because I like the spice. I just really do not like the taste of this pickle. I think I prefer pickles out of a jar instead out of a bag yeah oh that's really bad oh that's really bad I have a friend coming over tonight I'm gonna give him the pickle to try I want to see his reaction 
to the pickle because he was also very curious about these kind of pickles. So I'm gonna let him try this tonight, but for me, this pickle is a two out of 10. It gets a two because of the spice. It is spicy. That was actually terrible. I did not like that at all. I did not like that at all. And I usually love pickles. We usually love pickles, don't we? I just cleaned my bedroom and I just cleaned the living room and the kitchen. And I got laundry in the washing machine. So the last thing I have to clean is the hallway and my bathroom. And I'm cleaning because I have a friend that's coming over tonight. And I'm also cleaning because the floor of my apartment is gonna be finished. Um, so right now, I just have the floors, but I don't have, um, I don't even know what it's called in English, but it isn't finished, if you can see. So we're gonna put up those things to the wall to, you know, finish it up. That's gonna be happening tomorrow, so I figured that I'll just give the house a clean and a good vacuum with all your hairs laying around the house. Sometimes I wish I was a dog. Jeffrey's here. So we're gonna do what I told you guys earlier. He still doesn't know what he has to do, but um, please sit down. <laughs> Okay. Remember how we went to the Asian market? Yes. And we got three pickles? Yeah, we got three pickles, yes. Yeah, <laughs> yes, I do remember, yeah. I tried one of the pickles. I tried the hot mama. And you're gonna have to try it too. <laughs> And I'm not gonna tell you what I thought about the hot mama pickle. He knows I love pickles, by the way. <sighs> okay. Again, the hot mama pickle that I showed you guys earlier. I already did it on screen. So Jesus, okay. Well, it's like um, mm -hmm. th th those McDonald pickles yeah. on the hamburger. Yeah. If you, if you smell this like on steroids, it's like... <laughs> Okay. How bad is it? I'm not gonna tell you anything until you try. Then I'll tell you what I thought about the pickle. I'm not gonna tell you anything, but just remember that it is it's, a hot mama. It's a hot mama, okay. Oh god. Yeah. What do you think of the taste? I like the, the pickle itself. The pickle itself, it's, it's pretty damn good. I hate it. I think it's pretty good. It's like I a bit salty. I hate it. I think it's pretty, it's pretty okay. I hate it. I couldn't take another bite because I hated it so much. I've had worse. I, I, I gave it a 2 out of 10. A 2 out of 10? A 2 because it is spicy. The pickle itself, I think it's acceptable, actually. Really? It's acceptable, acceptable yeah. I've had way worse than this pickle. Do you want to try the other two then? Do you want to try the other spicy one first or the dill pickle? Let's do the dill first so that my mouth can <laughs> come back to its senses. And after that, we'll try the, the other spicy one. Oh, that smells really bad. Do you want me to try first? Sure. I'm just gonna take a bite. I'm not gonna say anything. I'm gonna try to keep a poker face. That, let's just do the smell first. Oh, that's a rough one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. The smell is... A <laughs> <laughs> more, more paper. Yes, please. Yes, please. Oh, no. It's very good. I can see it on your face. Mm, I'm not saying anything. Mm. Sure. 
Goodbye. Goodbye. Honestly? <laughs> Are you ready for the next one? I'm kind of scared of that one as well. Do we have the tapatio pickle? Second bite. Okay, it's gonna be good. Okay. Okay. I'm kind of excited now. It's, it's pretty good. I don't hate it. Let me just say that. I don't feel like I'm eating a pickle. I think I, I will place this one lower than the hot mama. You still like the hot mama? I absolutely hate the hot mama. Let me just try it again because... No, I'm not gonna try it again. Okay. That's absolutely <laughs> worse. garbage. Okay, and then this is probably gonna be my... Really? Rating. Yeah. Based on the taste. Of yeah, the, of based the... on the taste. But if I want pickles, I'm just gonna get pickles in a jar. <laughs> but thank you so much for trying these out and you can all eat them. Because I'm... I'm not gonna finish them. That's pretty good. <laughs>